Welcome back to Bat and Cat Chat! Uh, we are back to finish up this game. Jump down that first one. Oh, that's that's not a bad idea. Though, I don't remember where this hole takes us. <laughs> Hopefully it's not- oh. oh! See, I'm full of good suggestions! I wonder where it took us, though. I have no idea. I'm just happy I Probably the I very helped. bottom. I'm just happy I helped. Yep. Telltale Heights. I still helped. You... Because can't you come over here and then go in the little ladder thing and it'll bring you back up there? No. Oh. Maybe. I was going to say, there's stairs over here, though. I think this takes us back out the other way, but we'll see. Uh... Oh, yeah, that's right, because you had to jump. Yeah, but, I mean, I had to go back this way anyway, so it was either teleport or do that. Whatever. Alright. I still helped! You, you still helped. I did a thing! You, you definitely did a thing. <laughs> Jeez, Clay. They were all just minding their business. You just came in and, like, ran through them like you were that, that... That, that speed guy from from the boys, whose name I've forgotten. Not a clue. The one who ran through the chick at the very beginning of the show. Oh no, I know who you're talking about. Not a clue what his name is. It's been a really long time since that I, guy is like a I fucked saw up that show. Flash. Well, yeah, I think that was the point. Like a really <laughs> fucked up Flash. <laughs> See, I don't know. Flash is a sweetie, though. That might be the worst speedster I've ever seen, like, of all time. Even worse than the reverse Flash? Even worse than the Red Death, which was the Bruce Wayne Flash. I would say, I don't know who that is. You do. You are, Oh, you read Death Metal. Oh, was he in Death... I can't remember all of the evil Batman. I remember the one that was, that Wait, was, that was half Joker. Dark Knight's Metal. Regardless, I read them both, and you can't expect me to remember all of the evil <clears throat> Batman. I do remember continuously getting getting told that there was a freaking pirate Batman and still getting like no stories or like even like just like a one issue spin off anything based on pirate Batman, which I will complain about until the day that I die. I just want like and it's, I'm not asking for much. Literally one issue is all I need. I just want to see what this universe is like and how it operates. Pirate I, Batman. It's out there! Shit. There is a pirate universe! But they, they don't ever go there! You're definitely say, uh, telling the truth on that. I think they, they literally show it in like little clips and then never ever tell stories about it and it kills me because like that's like I really want pirate. I really want pirate Batman. Oh, I've seen Harley Quinn a couple times in these, like, little clips that they've shown us, and she's freaking adorable. Like, give us more of that, please. I want more of it. Ah, I made it. And instead, they just keep making Batman more depressed, and I'm just like, look, I get it. But can't we have fun with Batman for once and just, like, make him a pirate? Arr, no. <laughs> that was terrible! Ugh. Well, it's terrible that I got stuck with this part right here. I know what I need to do. Whee! Where's my hook shot? I uh, see. Don't you need to go across this bridge? Have you tried that yet? Yep. And I gotta rescue Marin. Marin, help! Don't you just have to hook shot her or something? Yeah, which is kind of fun. Yeah, I was saying that's so bad. That, that's so bad. Hey, Batman! Spear me, please. <laughs> oh God, that sounded bad. I don't know how to say this, but spear me, Batman. <laughs> you actually saved her how Batman would have, though. He would have used his hook shot. <clears throat> yeah, grappling hook. I was not Batman until I got my grappling hook in this game. That's that's very true. But where's your cape? Where's your cape? You can't be Batman without a cape. Uh, this Batman's got pointy ears instead of a cape. All, I mean, most Batman have pointy ears i'm gonna argue all batman have pointy ears actually but um um they also all have capes 
Like, it's, it's like, kind of, like, part of his whole thing. Actually, Batman Beyond does not have a cape. Yeah, but, <clears throat> um... I mean, like, he's not really Batman. Yeah, he is. Terry McGinnis, he was also Tim Drake. But no, he's Batman Beyond. Well, yeah, but that's <laughs> the Batman of the, uh... Yes, but no, it's different. So, still, Batman has cape. I mean, are you gonna say that just because it's a different time period, Batman's not Batman? Yes, because it's Batman Beyond. Well, now you just... <laughs> <clears throat> I just want to be right. <laughs> oh, I hate those things. I'm just saying capes are kind of his thing, so, like, he should have a cape, and therefore you not having a cape is kind of wrong. I mean, I get where you're coming from, but I don't have a cape. And my name's Batman. Deal with it. Th I, hate I this. mean, I've seen you in other room in rooms with other bats, so I'm not necessarily sure that you are Batman. Because how do I know that one of those bats isn't Batman? Why aren't you afraid of him? Yeah, yeah, that too. Like you're not even like a little bit afraid of them, and that's that's suspicious. that's suspicious. Is that that's sus? weird. Weird. So um. Yeah, I'm questioning this whole you <clears throat> claiming to be Batman thing. And, you know, people claiming to be Batman is definitely, like, a thing that happens pretty regularly. So how do I know you're the real Batman, hmm? God, you should really hmm? read some of the side stories going on right now. Hmm? Especially after everyone's like, oh, Batman's dead. Ugh. With the future state thing, like, six months ago. I'm just Everything saying. Everything is coming up. I'm just saying, like, how do I know? You could just be saying that you're Batman. Which, by the way... Anybody could put on pointy ears. I put on pointy ears regularly. <laughs> I think that, uh... That whole let's kill Batman trope is not a great look for things. What? Well, like, every time that... They're like, hey, what are we going to do with Batman? Well, why can't he just retire? Why does he always have to be dead in these stories? To retire. Um, because part of Batman's whole thing is he refuses to retire. <clears throat> oh, is that why him and Catwoman don't really settle down? It's why I'm fucking figuring, even though they keep teasing it, and then keep ripping it away from me every fucking chance I get. And then, they wouldn't even let me have anything nice. Like... And killed, like, the one guy that I was like, you know what? If she's not going to be with Batman, I'm okay with this dude. How dare you? Well, I mean, if he's going to demand that they be on a break over stupid reasons, but then... They both agreed on that. Yeah, but he's the one who was like, this should be a thing, and she was just like, I guess. Well, I mean, she was kind of... Like, I mean, like, they, bo they both this. agreed They both agreed on it in the same way that, like, breakups are ever mutual. Like, it's never fucking mutual. One person initiates Arguably, it. The one person... Catwoman fucked it up One person time. initiates it, and then the other one is just like, yeah, it was a mutual breakup. No! Hey, they would be married by now if it wasn't for Catwoman. Well, I argue that they, like... <laughs> They said that they got married. Like, I mean, we both know that they didn't because they did, like, the thing where it's like, yeah, we're married, but they didn't actually go do anything. Like, mm, <laughs> But, yeah, like, so technically, like, in their eyes, like, they, from what they said, they're married and Batman and Catwoman are forever, blah, 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 bullshit, bullshit, bullshit. But, but, Bat but. Batcat forever. Mm, then he was like, we're on a break. And she was like, okay, I guess. Like, that's not mutual. That was him being like, we're on a break. And then her just dealing with it. Alright, so we gonna get into the friends debate or something? <laughs> we were on a break! Well, I do want to point out that, <laughs> that Bruce did seem like... He obviously, like, was just kind of like, ugh. This guy so, obviously is into my woman, but also was just, like, kind of okay with it, too, because at the end of the day, he was like, I'm gonna win. Like, if it came down to you or me, I'm gonna win that fight, buddy. So before we, uh, 
<clears throat> go in here. Did you notice that this is the only bo uh, dungeon that you, you have, have to, to attack? Yeah! Crazy, huh? Yeah. It's kind of cute, though. Yeah. So, we are now at the turtle dungeon. Turtle rock. You killed the turtle! Well, it had to happen. You killed him! Anyways, what were you saying about the rock? Uh, the break? The what? Uh, the break. The rock? The break with, um, the friends. What? We were talking about the Friends episode. No, I wasn't. I was talking about Batman and Catwoman. Well, yeah, but then I compared it to the Ross Break thing. Okay. And then you were, like, saying something. And then I had to interrupt you because we were entering a dungeon. I was saying that Batman is stupid. That is true. Don't be Ross. Arguably, Don't be Batman. Catwoman's pretty dumb, too, because there's been many times that they're both just like, Duh, what are we going to do next? Makes well, no sense. Well, yeah, they're both stupid, but Batman's more stupid. That guy's getting easy. Batman's more stupid? Mm -hmm. He's the most stupid. Uh, Damien might be the dumbest one of them all. You know what? I'll let you have that. I do love Damien, though. And everybody hates me for it, and I don't care. <laughs> Well, it's just because he's a dumb little shit. He is like, a dumb little shit, and he, he makes a lot of very bad decisions and very poor decisions, but also, he's cute. He's also way too smart for his own good. And also, he's cute. Yeah, I wouldn't go And there. I also argue that, like, maybe if his mom wasn't such a bitch and his grandpa wasn't such an asshole, then, like, maybe he would be okay. Oh, his grandpa's been helping him a lot, actually, recently. He's, uh, pretty much... To uh, more of those like going off in the distance and think about your life things. Um, it's happening in Robin. You should totally check that out. So, did you just say that that like? <clears throat> Ra's al Ghul is like a pacifist right now. Yeah. Wow. Well, I argue that like he might be doing the right thing now, but maybe if he wasn't such a dick to begin with, that we wouldn't be at this point now where he has to go fix the mistakes he made. Well, as a comic book character, sometimes it takes him a thousand years or so. That's true. I do like a good redemption arc. <laughs> maybe I will read this. It's really good. There's this whole like death tournament and everything that Robin's like, or Damien's, because he's renounced Robin. Uh, that Damien's all about. I mean, I argue announcing the whole Robin thing isn't a terrible idea either. Eh. Eh. He, I mean, it's, it's all because of the Alfred thing. Oh, don't make me cry. Oh, yeah, he, he's having like a don't. conniption because of Alfred, so. No. Which makes sense. I mean, someone's got to be fucking mourning him still because it's Alfred. Well, I mean, I argue I never stopped. Yeah. I'm still upset he's spaghetti. I think, like, my favorite thing about reading Batman 89 right now is that Alfred is alive. <laughs> Alfred! I was say, Alfred's alive, and, and he gets to be good, good old Alfred that we know and love. I, am... I still can't believe they actually stuck to that. I was, like, sure that when we got to the end of that story, that uh, or at the end of that storyline, that at the very least, like, they were gonna, like, do some fake out Let's do it or MacGuffin. yeah like or they were gonna like figure out some way to bring him back to life because like i mean like when a comic character is dead and they really 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 want them back they find a way look at roy harper ah. it's like so like i mean like i just figured like they were they were gonna do something some deaths do have to stick though for canon to be a thing i didn't it didn't need to be this one like, honestly, honestly, why? No. <laughs> no. Couldn't, like, we have given Alfred, like, some kind of, like, thing and just, like, made it to where he never dies? Like, there's gotta be a thing that does that. Okay, how do I kill these fuckers? You have to hit him from behind. I don't know if you can do it while they're stunned, though. Try ramming into them with the feather. Oh, yeah. 
There you go. Thank you. You're welcome. But yeah, uh, I hate that that's the character death that stuck, but at the same time... Um, I would have rather it have been Batman. DC... Take Bruce! I had some major balls sticking to that one. Take Bruce! Not Alfred! Um, Anybody but Alfred! I mean, technically Batman was dead for a while. That's why Tim Drake's... Oh! Fun little piece of trivia. Did you know that uh, Damian Wayne is actually the first Batman that was trained under... Um, like, the first Batman that trained him wasn't Bruce Wayne? No. Uh, Tim Drake was Batman training his Robin, Damian. That's pretty cool. Yeah, Batman was lost in Tom following the crisis, and everyone thought he was dead. So, Tim Drake took over as Batman, and um, his Robin was Damian. Aww. Yeah, they actually brought that up in a recent comic, too. I must have missed that. In the Robin comic. Oh, then I didn't read that. Fantastic, though. I just, I love how they're doing callbacks like that. I don't like this room. I was gonna say, you must hate this room. This must be just, like, the worst room in existence for you. It is. Do, 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 do. Die, please. Thank you. I really didn't like this dungeon, but I do gotta say, I liked it better than the last one. I have a bad feeling. You literally just jumped off into that. That was funny. I have a bad feeling I'm not going to be able to do anything with this yet. And then you're going to have to come back? Yep. Eh, probably. Because this looks very magic sticky. Yeah, it does look like it needs some magic sticks. And you have no magic sticks. Got to use that magic stick. Ooh. What? Isn't that a song or something? N not that I know of. Oh, well. I'm surprised it's not. Bloop! So, can you push any of these? It does not appear so. So, oh, nope. It is what you think it is. I have to go back. Ha ha. All the way back. And made here it. we go. Snick. I like how he's trying to get you from like across like the thing. Oh, you like that, do you? I think it's kind of funny. I'll give you a spider. It is a cartoon snick. <laughs> it doesn't even really look like a snick. It has animu eyes. I said it was a fake spider. It has animu Zelda. eyes. Grant that spider was a little bit creepier. It sounded creepy. I hate <sighs> spiders. <sighs> I hate these things. They're not that bad. I actually like them. I put them in all of my dungeons. Well, it's the controls on them. Like, you accidentally tap the wrong direction a bit, and it goes the wrong direction. I think you can use the directional pad on those. You can, but then I get used to using the directional pad, and then... That's the thing. Just stop using the directional pad after you're done with the puzzle. You would think so. Alright, so where do I go? I don't know. I haven't been paying attention. I've been going on a rant about rant. how Batman and Catwoman are stupid. Yeah. Well, they're not smart. But they're adorable. When I, they are together. I mean, I'm really mad at them both. What do you think's over here? I don't know. A, a bombable wall, for one thing. I saw the bombable wall. So bomb it. I want to bomb it, bomb it. I want to bomb it, bomb it. Sounded like you said I want to vomit, vomit. Oh. Well, this wow, is that sucked. Oh! I mean, we could have done this a second ago, apparently, but oh. Oh, wow. Da, 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 da. Wow. Now you have the map. After all this time, the map aligned. So... I gotta go up that way. 
So the one in the middle, it looks like. Well, no. Or that one. I say because it's blocked off, isn't it? Well, yeah, or but I've got it? two keys. No, I mean like the way to it is blocked off. Well, that's mainly because... Oh, you know what? Mainly because I gotta go back to the first part of this. Which I'm totally gonna warp to because I remember I had this. Yeah, it makes things a little bit easier, thingy. doesn't it? Oh, hands down. This guy is so annoying. You can disappear, sir. Oh, I guess you can just push those. Yep. Or can you? Uh, which way do I need to do? This way. Ooh, that was almost bad. Yeah, it was almost bad. Oh my god, those guys are annoying. Yeah, I, did, I don't remember them being this obnoxious. They're literally the worst. Hey, a little link-shaped hole. I feel like I should probably go up the stairs first, though, right? But the link-shaped hole. Fine. You're gonna need your hook shot. <laughs> oh my god, what were you thinking? That was fun. That's what I was thinking. Oh my god. This is bounce right off. That one. was Did bad. You see that? that was bad. I thought it was incredibly. That was hilarious. bad. Ooh, we've made it to another part of the dungeon altogether. Uh How are you gonna How This is useless. Does it need the magic rod? It the needs magic the stick? magic rod. Or the magic stick. It definitely needs the magic stick. The magic stick of rod. Uh, what? <laughs> uh, I don't know okay. why you let me speak sometimes. I'm glad you think whatever you're saying is funny. I would like to be in on the joke. Oh, the joke is I'm stuck with slimes. Can you blow those up? Mm -hmm. Can you blow those up? Ooh, I think I can. I wonder what it does to blow them up. Might reveal something. I think you placed that last one in a poor position. Oh, there, we go. there you go. It revealed something. Hey, look, another another spot where you need a key. Yeah, and I'm not gonna be able to get out of here without a key. Oh, it, you know, I might be able to get a key. I say, why don't you try lighting the fires? This looks like it might be one of those time things where I'm gonna need the um. The what? The magic stick, but we'll see. Yep, nope. It's just... Just gives you light. But that's definitely a direction I need to go. But now what? Now we go up. Mummy! Oh, oh my god. Okay, now we go over. Oh, motherfucker. That was some bullshit. You know what? I'm pretty sure you can go up there and just do it from up there. I'm pretty sure I have to go up there. Because don't these respawn and I the don't... chest goes up there? I don't know. I remember that I don't being know. a thing. <gasps> you got it! No hookshot over there! You don't think this is it, do you? No! And how are you going to get down now? It's a long way. Man, that was just the worst. Well, this is a good spot to go to to get everything you need right before the boss, though. Yeah. You're like, yeah, too bad I discovered it. Not then. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, like, we, we're we always discovering these things when we don't have boss keys. You're like, I need the boss key. I do. I do need the boss key. All right. So I can't go that direction. You just need to go up. 
to defeat the monsters who hold the key, attack them from a higher place. Yeah, I gotta attack the Dodongos from a higher place. Yep. So there's no point in screwing with y'all. And then this time... Don't go there. Or wait. Well, where are you supposed to go? You know? Oh wait, no. Go up. Can you hookshot over there? I'm going to have to go back and get another key from somewhere. Huh. But from where? Okay. 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 Let me go back to... I'm very confused. Try and go up one of the ladders. Ugh. This is the last dungeon, so of course it's going to be complicated. Yeah, but you, you seem to have seen something, and I just don't understand what you've seen. Okay. Okay. Mm okay. Not that way. Okay. I, just, I haven't done all the things on that yet. I'm very confused still. That well, guy is annoying. Yeah, he's super fucking annoying. What are you? What is wrong with you? Alright, so that doesn't do shit. That goes up there, that goes there. Okay. Boop, 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 boop. Ow. Okay. Did you see him hit me? I saw you hit the wall, and the wall did absolutely nothing to you, so I don't think that was very fair of you. I... okay. Okay. I guess you have a valid argument Can you push there? up on one of those and then over with the other? Try the middle one, you dingus. Nope. Did you just call me a dingus? <laughs> yes, I did. Oh, okay. So, the only option that is available is up. I don't know how that's going to do anything. Uh, I don't know. Uh, There's a little platform up there. But it connects to nothing, it looks like. Hmm. And that way, and that way, and that way, and that way. I need to get up there. But I can't until we get... Huh. Alright. Have you... Mm. What is this room? Do you have way the compass? Here? Yeah, I think we do. What is this room way over here, though? We haven't been down there. I don't know. Uh, I guess let's go down there. I have so much confusion right now. Yeah. It's... We're getting at the fun part of the dungeons where it's like, well, I'm gonna, fuck you. I'm just gonna pull up a guide for this. Yep. What is this called? The. Oh, this is Turtle Rock. Turtle. Oh yeah, that's right, because you killed the poor defenseless turtle. I killed the turtle that was attacking me, yes. The poor defenseless turtle. The tur turtle that was attacking me. Oh, the hey, here we go. Oh my god. Those poor slimes. <laughs> you did not have the compass. Nope. But that should help. Alright, so there's a chest there. There's a chest in that room. How did you not get it? You've been in there. I think there's something up there on the ledge. Well, how do you get up there? I'm not sure. <sighs> That's the chest for the Dodongos. That's going to be the boss key. So I guess that's the key I got to try and find, uh, get. Yeah, I guess go there. Are you going? 
Yep, I'm going. Uh, sorry, I was just double checking the map because it's like, really? How do we not have all this filled out? Trying to at least get the magic rod. <laughs> Gotten this far. This is going to be a multi part episode anyway. I've resigned to this. Mm. Uh. What's up? Well. What? Um. Well, I think things might have been done slightly out of order, so trying to figure out where we need to go next on this guide that I found is... is um, so the, the treasure chest in this room, I'm gonna need the magic thing for. Because <laughs> that's how you shoot the fireballs. So... I think that we should probably just cut it here for next time and figure it out and come back prepared to get the magic rod. Alright then. Well, I guess next time we'll figure out where the heck we need to go. For part two of Turtle Rock, the biggest dungeon. <laughs>